Thank you.
I want to know how you can maintain such consistent levels of energy. What's your secret? Are Fang and his machinations behind this somehow? It's the bird, isn't it? They're amazing! You're really efficient, you know that? Thanks for all your hard work, partner. Now it's my turn to get the tourists to come. Watch me. I used to have a problem with drinking too much Yakmel milk. Luckily, Owen helped straighten me out. Now I'm down to just a glass before bed. Thanks, it's really nice. In all my travels across the free city, I can say with great confidence, there's no one around with my kind of selection. Last stop for rare items, right here, Builder.
gang are a slippery bunch. They've managed to stay one step ahead of our every move. But mark my words, justice always gets his man. Sooner or later. For me? Thanks.
Welcome, everyone. Trudy has some exciting news to announce. No fooling. Trudy, if you please. Um, I'd like to give an update on how the latest tree planting experiment went. We're still collecting data, and Zeke is communicating with the botanist in Highwind, as well as the church to get some second opinions. We're also working on growth trajectory, as well as the amount of water needed. With that said, yes, the rumors are true. It actually went really well. Improbably well. You can go over to our little woods by the Gecko Station ruins and check it out yourself. We were able to grow vegetation in the desert. All thanks to the hard work of Zeke and Director Chi, as well as our two resourceful builders. I just knew it! Sand Rock forever! Wow! I suppose when you keep trying, good things happen. Way to go, y'all! I can really see that ray of hope. Now, let me introduce this gentleman next to me. For those of you who haven't met him, this here is Ernest, the reporter from Atara who wants to do a story on our mayor's progress with the Little Woods. I believe some of you know me already, but to those of you who don't, hello, I'm Ernest. I've been doing a few pieces on Sandrock, and my next one will be on this new method of planting you all have discovered. I'm going to be interviewing some of you in the coming days, and also taking pictures of the trees you have growing out in the desert. It'll be an ongoing piece. I'll be putting out articles as this greenery project continues to make progress. Ahem, uh, yes. We welcome you back with open arms, Mr. Ernest. Uh, that is, once the forest has grown out a bit more, uh, which it certainly will. Wonderful. As they say in Bonarock, counting your chickens before they hatch is a good way to predict how many chickens you'll soon have. Right. Anywho, Everyone is invited to be in a group photo, so I hope you can all try to stay flexible within the next few days. City Hall will send out a letter with the time and date as soon as possible. Uh, this could be my big break. You all wouldn't want to miss a chance to be in the biggest paper in the Free Cities, would you? So then, if there are no objections, for the feature photograph, I thought it would be most fitting to feature the person most responsible for all our success. Give it up for the botanist who never bowed out, Sandrock's very own Zeke! Whoa, hold on. I said I'd do the group photo. I don't want to be on the front page or nothing. You should do it, Trudy. Uh, me? Oh, well, I... Trudy, we can't just put any Johnny come lately as the face of Sandrock. Trudy come lately? What's she done for us since she got back anyway? Other than almost getting both our builders killed at the shipwreck ruins. Way I see it, person we ought to be thinking other than Zeke is good minister Matilda. Now hold on a tick. This is our ray of hope. Yeah, when I heard that, I was like, whoa. I mean, Matilda has led us through some of the most troubled times I've ever seen in this town. I says we put Matilda on the front of one of them funny papers as a code commemoration for all she's done in this town. All in favor, say aye. <laughs> there you have it! Balls in your court, Mayor! Uh, uh, sure. Uh, I mean, if that's how everyone feels about it. Minister Matilda, at the behest of our fine citizens, would you do us the honor of appearing on the front page of this article? Oh, I couldn't! The mob has spoken! Really? It's all right. You've earned this, Matilda, as well as Zeke and our builders. We couldn't have done it without you either. <laughs> uh, 
goodness, y'all. I'm at a loss for words. I only ever wanted what was best for Sandrock. I was only ever doing what the light put me here to do. But if it'll make y'all happy, then yes, I accept this exceptionally high honor. <laughs> Thank you, Sandrockers. Does this work for you, Ernest? Um, sure. It's up to you guys, I guess. Uh, all, all right then. Everyone, keep an eye on your mailboxes. I'll let everyone know when we're ready to take the photo. Meeting adjourned. I couldn't... Conserve water. Conserve water! Uh, serve water? Howdy! Mm hmm. Thanks. It's really nice. Barkeep, fix me up with only the heartiest of meals. A warrior requires sustenance. Hmm. Well, we have hot and sour fish. That's kind of high protein, but it might be too spicy for you. I laugh in the face of such a meager challenge. Too spicy for pen? <laughs> I laugh again. If you're into spicy stuff, we actually just got some Duvo's peppers in. I've been wanting to make a Lucian crepe but no one's been brave enough to try it yet. Can I fix you one? <laughs> you said Duvos peppers, the spiciest peppers in the entire world? The known world, yes. Uh, the ones known for causing anyone who consumes one to immediately dunk their heads in the nearest water source as some feeble attempt to alleviate the pain. One and the same. Hmm, I don't know. I mean, we've all got a big day tomorrow. Such a spicy pepper could be not so good for my stomach, you know? Aw, oh, don't tell me the big, brave protector of Sandrock is afraid of a widow chili pepper. It's just... Wah, my tummy. That's you right now. Server woman, what's gotten into? I wonder what people would say if they knew. All right. All right? All right. Ahem. Ha ha! Thrice I laugh, for I, Pen, the protector of Sandrock, was only pretending to be afraid. One Lucian crepe barkeep. Post haste. Coming right up. Thank you. 
Thanks. What kind of gift is this? See ya. Hey, wow. See ya. Ha. See ya. Hello. Thank you. Hi there. Oh. A 
Thanks. It's really nice. I do like this town. And all the... So long, partner. <laughs>